Hi, tubers. Hello. Okay, we're here with the husband tag, finally. Well, he's finally actually my husband. Yeah. Yeah. Boom. Okay. So we're going to start and try to make this kind of fast. Well, not fast, but not like there's like a million questions, so we're not going to do all of them. Okay. So we're going to do the first one. Where did we meet? We met in high school in eighth grade in oh, Toledo. We met in ninth grade. Eighth grade. We met in ninth grade. Yes, right. I so forget. I think that means that we met at school because that's where we met, technically. <laughs> technically speaking. Where was our first date? The mall at the movies. Yeah. Sounds right. Did we eat? No. I think we did. We no. went to Taco Bell. No. Cause Remember I drank coffee that one time? I don't think it was at the mall yet. It wasn't there when it first opened. We didn't go to the mall when it first opened. Yeah, it wasn't too far after that. We probably did eat, because I always eat yeah. when we go on a date. So we probably True. did eat, but yeah, it was the movie, I think. Uh, I want to say it was Batman, but I don't think it was. Okay, either way. It was a long time ago, so who knows. How did you know I was the one? Because you're just so beautiful and smart. That's how I knew. I coached him. Okay. <laughs> um, what was your first impression of me? That you're just bubbly and always joyful, happy, and smiling. Okay. <laughs> when did you first meet my family? I met your dad at the mall. It wasn't the same time. It wasn't <laughs> on the first date. We just spent a lot of time at the mall. We had nothing else to do where we lived. I probably met your mom before that. I can't remember. She's loud and everywhere, so. <laughs> so I probably met her before. I just can't remember. <clears throat> I've seen her more. You met her when you came to pick me up the first time. Probably, yeah. From my house, because my mom was like really nervous, like, I don't want nobody driving you, and blah, 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 and, and I like, begged her if I could go with Clayton, so, <laughs> then he came to my house, and she met him, and it was horrible, it was like the most stressful, uh, stressful situation, because we had a dog, and it was like a big dog, but it was in the house, and for some reason, like right before Quinn got there, he just like the biggest crap, don't know why, so the whole house stunk, and my mom was just freaking out, she thought that Quinn was gonna, <laughs> <laughs> she was like, clean this up, and she was like being so mean, like, trying to spray, like, spray the house and everything because she didn't want Quinn to think that, I don't know, like, our house always smelled like poop. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. My mom's weird like that. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see. Do we have a tradition? No. Yes, we do. I don't think so. I mean, we, we go to the movies tradition. every Tuesday. Yeah, we go to the movies with my dad and my brother every Tuesday. Um, what else do we do? We have traditions. We have a lot of them. They just don't feel like tradition. Probably. Don't say we don't have... We have traditions. Got yeah, it. we do. Somewhere. <laughs> we <laughs> have traditions. We do go to the movies, like, about every week with my dad. And we usually do try to go to the drive-in at least, like, once a summer. We yeah. go to Nettie's. Like, the first day is warm enough to go. Yeah. Sometime when it's not warm <laughs> enough to go for this person over here. And... Where? We have tradition. Not even make me try to think of all the tradition that we have, but we do. I don't know. I don't know any others. We used to go to your family on Christmas Eve. We usually do that. Used to. Yeah, used to. It was old tradition. That wasn't that old. I don't we know. did last year. And what other traditions? We have tradition. Probably do. I can't think of any. <sighs> hmm. Well, those are like our, probably our biggest ones. We, yeah. we do stuff. We go to, like, Michigan a lot. We go to Cabela sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. Would that be a tradition? Yeah. Would that just be a tr random trip? But we do that a lot. That's bogus. We have plenty of traditions. We sleep in a lot. That's a tradition. <laughs> we have lots of traditions. It's just, like, it's our normal life, so we don't think about and it. And we've been married for a week, so there's more traditions. We've stuff. almost been married two weeks at this point. And we have lived together for a whole year, so you think we have more tradition than that, but we do have tradition, and we just can't think of them right now. But we do. So just know that guy. All right, all right. <laughs> he just wants to move on. When was our first road trip? I don't know. Yeah. Chicago was the school. Well, we haven't had one by ourselves, really, but... Yes, we have, Kent. I suppose that counts, yeah. Yeah, that counts. I suppose. But Chicago was way before that. Yeah, but you weren't driving. Yes, I guess, but it was still a trip that we pulled on, and it was on the road. I think Boston was our first, like, real road trip. But we still were. 
we didn't uh, drive then either. I, if I go with your idea, then Boston was our first one. So I got a little support. Yeah, but I think like Boston was my first real one because it was long and it was like all the ins and outs of road trips, like truck stops and sleeping in the car and yep. listening to music Very and sharing time. iPods. Oh, that was a tradition. Well, not really a tradition, but we used to share our iPods a lot. Yeah. Because I didn't have one. <laughs> so we used to do the one earphone thing. We did that like half the way to Boston. Also because he had way better music than mm, I did. Always. Originally. Always. Because I didn't know how to get music legally. Okay. So, there's that. Um. Let's see. I don't know what I asked that one. I kind of already asked that. Um, what do we argue about the most? The most? <laughs> what do we argue about the most? Uh, I don't know. Cleaning up the house. Yeah. Probably. Yeah, we, we argue about that. Not a lot. Because I, cause I do most of the cleaning and she doesn't. That is not true. We That's argue why. because I freaking do everything, and he has like two jobs, and he forgets about them all the I time. Do them. No, he forgets about them a lot. But we don't <laughs> argue a lot. I'm just like, clean it up, and then he cleans it because he yeah. knows that he should have already done that. So that, or probably we argue about money. She always wants Popeyes. Popeyes is expensive. He is the one that just asked about going to Popeyes, not me. And the problem is, it just I think every young couple argues about money a lot, especially when they're first starting, because you don't have a lot of money, and, you know, you're just trying to get on your feet, and you're trying to get started with real life, so, you know, it's not like we, like, fight about money, but it's just, you know, really, yeah, we only have so much to go around, and that means we can't go every place we wanted to go, so, like, I might think that we need new carpet. And he might think that we need to pay the rent. So, <laughs> we need to argue about that. <laughs> Probably. And most of the time he wins because there's no point in getting carpet if you have nowhere to live. So, there's that. So, yeah. Cleaning and money. Because we have none. <laughs> but when we have some, we're not going to argue about it anymore. I'm just going to buy a new carpet. Okay. So, we got that. And... Oh. Who said I love you first, and where was it? Me. I said it when I was at home. She was getting on the bus from school. That is not true. To get home from school. Yeah, you were on the bus, I think. No, I, I wasn't. I was at home. Were you at home? Why? We were texting. Why were you at home? I was at school and I said it. No, you weren't. I'm getting confused, but I said it first. Yes, he did say it first. We're going to just leave that. I don't know if that is true. But... It's like six years ago. No, the first time I remember... Like, the first time I remember, we were texting. Yeah, it was text. So how were you at school? I'm at home. I was at home. I was at home, but I was living room, walking around. Like I kids. think I was getting off school or something, because I remember being outside. I think maybe I stayed home from school. Downtown. Like, maybe I was sick, and that made you want to say that you love me, because you missed me. Probably. I remember being at school right along the side right there. Well, so I was... I will never forget this, because I was at home, and I was pacing around like I always do when I texted him, for whatever reason. I was so nervous mm. and excited. And... I was, we were texting him, and he, I was texting him, and he texted me back and said something, and then it was like, I, what, I-L-Y, and I was like, what does illy mean? That makes no sense to me. Like, he tried to be sweet, like, tried to slide it in, like, mm, you're gonna say it really cool, and then it won't have to be brought up. Well, of course, I have no idea what that means, so we had to bring it up. <laughs> and I was like, what does I-L-Y mean? And he was like, it means I love you, and I'm like, <gasps> <laughs> so that's how she reacted. That's really exactly how I reacted Again. in my living room by myself <laughs> at home. I was so happy. I, I remember like, texting my best friend like right after like, oh my god, Quincy, I loved you. Oh my god. Well, he didn't really say I love you. He said I L Y. But same thing, you know. Like it was. <laughs> she was like, really? Oh my god. It was great. <laughs> it was very good. So that happened. Okay. Who wears the pants in the relationship? Me. I'm wearing pants right now. She's wearing a dress. He's wearing boxers right now. Oh, uh, I mean, I, mean, I pants. am wearing a dress. So I clearly wear the pants. In the relationship, I think I wear the pants, and he wears. All women do. The also pants. All women wear the pants, so it's not a, it's not a question. All women wear the pants. That's right. But in our pants, in our relationship, like the pants are mine, but like he can put his leg in it sometimes. Maybe it's like 
you like the one leg, one leg pen. We I share a pen. I want to share pants. Uh, they're my pants, but I let leg. him put no, his leg in. No, I can't be my pants and you put my, your leg in my pants. No, because they're my pants. I want to wear pants. You can wear a leg. I want to wear your pants. Pants, pants are tight. Like, I, we already talked about it. <laughs> and we talked about this like one time, like way late at night. I don't know, like driving on the road. I don't know why we were, what we were doing. But I was like, it's like I'm the president and you are the CEO. Like, we both run this, but in our own way. Like, I call the shots, but you also run the blades. <laughs> Whatever. We both run the CEO is higher. She doesn't know that actually. Well, they're supposed to. They're supposed to be equal. Like, I'm the president, and they're you're the equal. chief. Or like, I'm the president. Like, I'm always gonna be the president. You guys need to know that. I'm the president, and he's like the king. And we just like hang Heck out. Yeah. Yeah, you can be the king. I'm Heck the yeah. It's better. It's better. Sure. And we just, you know, <laughs> we meet up at our daily meetings and just like look what's about to happen what's about to go down curtains are rent and he's like rent stop saying that and I'm like okay but as the president I say okay alright so it's the same thing so that's what that's my answer and your answer okay if I'm watching TV what am I watching something on oxygen (laughs) or on TV so, you gotta tell them, like, what show right, am Teen I... Teen Mom or Oprah? Or Dr. Phil? I don't watch Oprah. Or Dr. Phil? Dr. Phil. I love Dr. Phil. Phil. Every morning that we don't have to go to class, I turn it on, because Dr. Phil's on from, like, 8 to, like, 12 or something, just episode after episode. I love Dr. Phil, and I, I do love Teen Mom, and Bridezilla's, and Bad Girls Club sometimes, not a lot. Bad Girls Club. Bad Girls Club. Okay, let's see what else. What is one food I do not like? Do not Man, you like everything. It's not a good question. There is food I don't like. Let me think then. Like, we don't like the same food. You like olives? I don't like olives. I don't like potatoes. I hate them. And most, most vegetables on pizza? I eat vegetables on pizza. I'll eat bell peppers or tomatoes. That's great. What is the one big vegetable I don't like? I can't remember, but I know what it is. Makes me not do well. <laughs> Blow up the house. You know what it is. I can't remember. Onions. Oh yeah. <laughs> First of all, they blow up the house. I hate. Uh, I don't even. I don't like how onions taste unless they're grilled. But like, oh my god, if I eat no a raw onion like, like a burger or something. Oh no man. one likes onions, man. It's just, it's Some people do like yeah, onions. They're retarded. Don't say you're tired. It's a waste of a food. Shot it. It's a terrible food. Everybody agrees. Well, apparently all I don't like is olives, but I don't like onions. I don't like eggs. And I don't like, I don't like mushrooms. And you know that. We still think of vegetables. We still say most vegetables. I like vegetables. I just don't like onions, olives, or onions. Okay, whatever. I'm not going to ask that because you're not going to know it. I would know it. If we go out to eat, what kind of salad dressing do I get? You get ranch and Caesar. The only two dressings in a in possible. Donald, not the camera over there. You almost did earlier. No, I didn't, because I'm watching my feedies. I didn't even move my leg. Yeah. <laughs> ranch or Caesar, mostly. That's pretty much it. I don't. I mean, sometimes, yeah, mostly just ranch or Caesar. Sometimes I'll get Italian if I'm feeling freaky. Okay. What shoe size do I wear? Nine and a half. <gasps> I wear nine. Nine and a half sometimes too. Sometimes nine and a half. Yeah, so I would. Next question. What else? Um. Hmm. I don't really want to ask you this, but I just want to see if you know. What's my favorite type of sandwich? Turkey. No. Turkey sandwich. What do we get sometimes when we go to the mall? That's my favorite type of. You stole this sandwich from me. Now you're trying to pin it. It's your favorite sandwich. Is she a bigger inch? No! But that's not my favorite one. Philly cheesecake? Yes! It's a sandwich. It's a cheesecake. Philly cheesecake is my. Stop! You you already almost knocked over. Close your legs sometime. I don't know why you have to sit like you're freaking. I don't even know. 
Yes, Pajamas. Philly cheesesteak is my favorite kind of sandwich. And then all of a sudden, Quinn has stolen it and decided that that's what he's going to order all the time. That's my favorite sandwich is Philly cheesesteak. It is so good. She's the only one who's going to have it. From the Great Steak Escape. Yes, I'm the only one who can have it. Great Steak Escape Philly cheesesteak with a large lemonade and um, sweet and low in it. Mm. Yes. Mm-hmm. No, that's what I want. I want to go back to Johnny Rockets now. Do you want to go to I want to go to Great Steak Escape at the mall. That sounds so good right now. Oh, my God, I'm starving. <laughs> We're always starving when you guys though. see us. I don't know why I only film when we're starving. <laughs> we're starving! Feed us! Okay. Um, I'm not gonna ask these because kinda silly. What is something you wish I wouldn't do? Eat onions. <laughs> okay, that's a good answer. <laughs> I won't. Okay, and... I have one, two more. Okay, what is one unique talent that I have? Are you saying I have no talent? You have a lot of talents, but I don't know which one to go with. <laughs> Probably that you're the most caring person in the world. <laughs> is that a talent, being caring? Yeah, no one's that way anymore. Okay, I'll take that. It's a talent. No one, no one has that. Okay, so I'm caring. And why did you fall in love with me? Because you're you, duh. Dumb question. Because you're you. Well. No one else knows why, but that's why. Because I'm me. Only I know the actual answer to that, and that's only I know what that exactly means. (laughs) Okay. Well, that's the end of our husband tag. And what? Like, today is... Friday. So tomorrow we'll be married two weeks. Mm-hmm. Yay! And we have a 4.45 checkout, I guess. No, before that. 4. That's 4.4. Four. Oh, yeah. To leave so we can catch our flight Probably on our two-week no. anniversary. Before that. Three. We'll be in an airport <laughs> trying to get back home to our kitties. And I miss them. Oh, I hope they were. I do. I miss I hope cat. they're not there sometimes. Me too, the but I miss them. We the haven't way. seen them in like five years. If Boots is there, that'll be alright, but if Turtle runs away, I'll be okay. I want Turtle. I had a dream about Turtle last night. Oh, Lord. I really did. I had a dream that he was there, but he was like all tied up in some Christmas lights for some reason. <laughs> I don't know. I miss them. I hope that they're okay. Mom's supposed to send us a picture today. <clears throat> well, anyway, that's our husband tag. So now I think you guys should start subscribing to me. Tell them to subscribe to me. Yeah, subscribe to her. Subscribe to me. <laughs> I love doing YouTube right now. It's like my thing. I love it. If you subscribe to us, then we'll do more videos. And I'll make him... Yeah. And also, leave some comments and give me some um, ideas of what you might want to see next, if anything. If not, I'm just going to keep making my own videos, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But anyway, yeah, give me some ideas or some requests you'd like for us to do or like for me to do. And I will do them. So, thanks a lot. Bye. And we'll see you later. Bye.